Hello and welcome to this tutorial guide on how to create a basic process map using the Nimbus Web Author Client. Here you can see we have the Web Author Client open. Here you have all your basic Nimbus functionality on our web server. We're using version 10.1 of our server to do this. So if we select the Processes tab, you can see here we've already got a basic process map guide created that I made earlier in the client. But if we want to create it in the web, we have to do things just a little bit differently. So firstly, let's add a new folder, which I will name Web Processes. And we'll just keep the access rights blanket for the moment. Just hit Add Folder there, and that is added. We then go to Web Processes. We can go to Add New Map. And as you can see, how to create a basic process web here. And the owner and author is my typical author account. If I hit Create Map, here we have a basic layer that you'll be greeted whenever you come in to creating a basic process model. So I'm just going to delete what's already here. So we can start fresh. So now we have our blank page. If we go down to the draw icon here, we can select the activity tool. We've got this box, we can move it around here. This will give you the basic guide on how to create activities. So in this case, similar to my first, just follow the same model here. Okay, and then we'll add a second one. Add a third. Move this up here. It will tell you the distance between the two. There we go, we can have an equidistant apart. So here is our basic process map up with our activity boxes. We just need to add our flow lines, which we can do so here. Add another. And a further one. And finally, our exit line. Go to this, similar to my first one. Move this line about. I want it to come from the bottom line if I can. And there we go. And then I can add a reason why here. And there we go. Here we have our basic process model again in the web client. You'll see we have the who icons here. This is to add resources through, which we'll cover in a later video. But once we're done here, you can hit the save icon, which will save your process, and then done. Now I'll exit out. And here you are. So as we can see, we've got a small problem here, where text is going through the line. So if we just select the Edit Diagram button, and just move it slightly, but hopefully, And there we go. So that's all for this introductory guide on how to create a basic process in our web author client. Please join me in our next video where we will look at 
creating drill downs in the web or the client also. So until then, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.